everyone. Hey guys, welcome back to another Crumble video. Today we have four cookies. We are so excited for these cookies because they, they all look so good. Crumble came at us mm -hmm. this week. I mean, we've had, I think, three out of the four cookies, but yeah. they're just so good. Mm -hmm. So we are excited to try four cookies, and we hope you guys um, are able to get something out of this video yeah. and, and see if they're worth it for you guys, too. So sure. which one are we trying first? Uh, Red Velvet. All right, so mm -hmm. here's our, all the four cookies that we have. It's kind of hard to see, yeah. but man, they these cookies are massive this week. I don't know if it's... Mm -hmm. like, I don't know, but they're just huge. They look huge, so, yeah. They look bigger than normal. We'll try red velvet, and you mm -hmm. can go ahead and explain what it is. So this is a red velvet cupcake, a red velvet cookie topped with a swirl of delicious vanilla cream cheese frosting and a sprinkle of crumbly red velvet pieces. This cookie, I'm not going to be able so to show soft. you guys. It it's literally it falls, crumbles. It falls off the bone. I can't even show you the cookie. The falls off the bone. It, it's just very Here's soft. Here's a little slice uh -huh. of the of the um cookie here but very thin yeah. very i love cookies that are soft so i'm really excited and though Cream red velvet frosting. used to be like one of my favorite it was one of their first flavors that they've had yeah. so let's see if it's still really good i haven't mm -hmm. had it in a minute so cheers cheers mm. yep wow it's so good this is one of the cookies that I think that can have a lot of frosting on it and not be like so overwhelming. Overwhelming. Red velvet's good. It's simple but tasty. I think does it have chocolate chips in it? Mm, I think it might in the batter of the cookie. It doesn't it, say, but I think it, it is. Guys, I, you guys should mm. try red velvet cookies. This one is good. It's really good. It's mm -hmm. not super out there with flavor. It tastes like red velvet. Yeah, it tastes just like a red but velvet. But it's very soft, it's easy to eat. Mm -hmm. And I think it's really good. This is, reminds me of why it's one of my favorite cookies. Yeah, so. it, it is. It's literally identical to like a red velvet cupcake, a red velvet cake. And it's really, mm. really tasty. You like it? I like it. I actually like, can't, I couldn't remember the flavor very well from the last time I had it, but wow. biting into it, it's, it actually is really good. Wow. And I really love their cream cheese frosting. So All right. it just, it's good. Good, so definitely mm -hmm. try that one. Yeah. All right, we'll move on to the next cookie. Mm -hmm. Which are we trying? I think we should just go down. Go in order. Okay, uh -huh. all right, all right. All righty. So we're going to try now the Malo Sandwich featuring Oreo. This is an Oreo Super Sandwich, a fluffy, creamy center sandwich between two chocolate brownie cookies with Oreo cookie pieces. Guys, this thing is freaking massive, massive for a cookie. Here is mm -hmm. another side um, part of the cookie. This thing is huge. Like, it's like I, my face is gone. <laughs> so... Let me break it up. I'm just going to break it in half. Okay. I love Oreo. We've had this one before too. Oh my gosh, you're right. It has a brownie. Uh -huh. I feel like they the try middle. to perfect it. Like, you know when they come back out with some stuff? I feel like sometimes this. they perfect Sorry. it. Okay. it. This is very messy today. There is a brownie in the middle of the cookie. I kind of want this piece. No, I want it. I was All right. The Let's try this. Wow. I'm going to try yours. These are chocolate brownie cookies. It's not a brownie on the inside. You just broke it. Oh, there's a cookie? It's the it's the cookie. Oh. All right. Well, here it goes. This massive cookie here. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, That's good. It is just like a giant Oreo. Yeah. What do you think? Mm, it, it's so good. I think it's so good because like the the like the cream on the inside it's like cold it's mm -hmm. not like room temperature it's like cold so well and i really enjoy the fact that it's a brownie mm. cookie it just makes the flavor so much better rather than just like a yeah. chocolate cookie oh i don't know oh my goodness wow mm -hmm. it is straight up oreo oh see yeah there are cookie, like chunks in it this cookie is so good i could really eat this whole thing like just if you love yeah. Oreos, this is a mm -hmm. giant life-size Oreo. Good. It is so good. I must try. I mean, if wow. you haven't already. But. Man, they're really kicking it mm -hmm. up a notch this week. Like I said, we've tried these cookies, but when you put them all together mm -hmm. in one week, man, it's so good. It is good. And, you know, sometimes, like, it's been a while since you've had a cookie, so mm -hmm. it's, like, a good reminder of, like, the flavors. Oh that one is so good. 
Wow. wow. All right. <laughs> Definitely worth going out of way for this one. Definitely go get your so mallow sandwich. Let's see what the next one is. So next we're going to have the cinnamon fry bread. This is a melt in your mouth fry bread cookie smothered with melted butter and topped with delicious scoop of cinnamon buttercream. So this is like one of my favorite cookies because what? it's just so simple, not so intensely sweet, but like. What is fry oh, bread? Though? It is just so good. All right, so this cookie, there's mm -hmm. not much to it. I kind of took the butter off of it already. Or I mean, I spread the spread butter. Spread it out, yeah. So it's a thin cookie. Um, mm -hmm. I know this one is good. I just don't remember the taste of it. So let's try it's it. Very, I think it's like a cinnamon. Cinnamon fry. Cinnamon fry. All right, here it goes. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Well, mm -hmm. well, it's very cinnamony. Soft inside. Cinnamon crispy outside. I think this one is very subtle. Mm -hmm. um, surprisingly, it's probably going to be the most subtle out of all the cookies that we have today. But in my opinion, I think that it just tastes like a cinnamon cookie, like a sticker to a cookie. Mm. Yes, it has the added butter on it, but honestly, it's probably my least favorite one out of this week's cookies. Like, wow. it's just... I don't know, the other cookies have so much flavor and so much like kick. Yeah. This one, it's not bad. I'm just saying, like when you put it stacked up no, against the No, I mean, yeah. Cookies, I agree. It's just it's just such a it's such a good cookie. Yeah. Like so simple. I think this with like some milk would be really mm -hmm. good. Like cinnamon, like warm cinnamon with yep. uh, um, some milk would be really it's like good. A little... But I don't have much else to say, but besides it's yeah. it, it tastes like cinnamon. The butter on top's really good. Mm -hmm. Instead of it being like a frosting, it's more of a buttery paste. But yeah. Yeah. It's really good too, so all right, let's move on to the very last one. This cookie we have not tried. This one is a brand new cookie mm -hmm. and we were so excited to try it, so. So this is called Strawberry Shortcake, a cakey cookie topped with silky whipped cream, house-made strawberry jam, and freshly chopped strawberries. Guys, right, this one it, is the presentation a monster. Looks good. This one is so, it looks like a cake, this thing. There it goes. So good. It looks like a cake. I don't, I kinda wanna just break don't it. Don't break it. Okay, so let me cut it. <laughs> strawberry Shortcake. A strawberry shortcake Gosh. is what it's called. This is like a monster. How do you even like get all the bites, get all the flavors? Do you like strawberry shortcake? I like strawberries. Guys, you guys need to see a, a half cut right through the middle of this. This one's chilled, that. by the way. Cold. That is just crazy. All I'm right. Let's, let's try this. I got to go right for the middle. Me too. Cheers. Well, Cheers. not really, but... Whoa. Wow. Oh my goodness. Wow. Let me take another bite before I comment. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. That is a lot of cookie. So, I, have a, I have a good, like... Go ahead. Say it. Say it right what now. What I think it tastes like. Strawberry shortcake? Think, well... Yes, but I think it tastes like angel bread. That's what it's supposed to be. With whipped cream mm -hmm. and strawberries. That's what that's what strawberry shortcake is. I know. It tastes just like that. Basically just said the longer version of strawberry shortcake. Mm. This cookie, I love. let me explain say my opinion. I think I like the the uh, all star or the shining star of this cookie is the strawberries. I think they're they're cold. They're like like take them right out of the fridge freezing. Um, it hits you right away with a, a, a room temperature cookie. The cookie is so dense, like you have trouble eating it because it tastes like a like a very thick, it's dense, a cakey like cookie. cake, cakey cookie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so